I came out to my folks when I was 17 years old and they kicked me out of the house. That was their response uh, literally overnight. So on a Monday I had a family, on Tuesday I had no family. And when they kicked me out, West Hollywood took me in. Heidi and I have known each other for 21 years. Of that, we've been married for, for 20. Um, or we, we count it as we've been married for 20. But of course, we didn't really get married until about halfway through uh, the relationship. We have to be, I think, among the first couples in the United States to, um, to have a marriage license um, from the state of Massachusetts, the very first state. So very, very proud of that. And I said to Caitlin, the minute that she walked into my life, I said to her, I am an activist. You know, I, I get up at seven, you know, I brush my teeth a certain way, and I'm an activist. And Heidi has done so many different things um, on a national level with her activism and working for so many different causes that affect us federally. And now to be able to take it to um, City Hall in West Hollywood and to the City Council, um, would just be amazing. Heidi really brings a new sense of what the future of West Hollywood can hold. Not just for women, not just for lesbians, but really for, like, this is the new city we need to create. West Hollywood is a city uh, that has brought a, a very eclectic and diverse group of people together. We coexist together extremely well, which is highly unusual. Uh, and then we export that that cultural diversity uh, to the rest of the world. The problem is that we haven't done that it's on a 21st century problem-solving basis when it comes to improving the quality of our lives. Knowing Heidi as long as I have, I can't think of anybody who I would rather see on that council. I can't think of anybody who's smarter, who's more passionate, who um, understands the issues better. What we're facing today are problems of uh, traffic and parking, of uh, overdevelopment, and affordable housing are probably our three biggest problems. The problem is that council has not addressed those issues in ways that have actually improved those things. Traffic is getting worse, parking is getting worse. People who know West Hollywood know uh, exactly what I'm talking about. What I bring is a vision for the future that is specifically about problem solving with that 21st century technology for what is now a 21st century city. When you connect with residents about the issues that are important to them and you're honest about the opportunity to follow through and then follow through, that's what makes a big difference and that's why I think Heidi is a perfect candidate for our city. I support her just wholeheartedly. So I endorse Heidi 100%. If I could endorse her more than 100%, I would do that. There are solutions, there are good solutions, and we just need to have the will in City Hall and the vision to actually implement that. Well, I would be wrong if I didn't say you have to vote for Heidi just because she's got great bangs. <laughs>